Hello and welcome to this video. Today what we are going to be doing is we are going to be finishing up the Mockley, our foam Mockley. Um, got my ladle, my Mockley here. We've got a strainer here that's been lined with cheesecloth. Got a vessel to hold the Mockley as it strains off the rice. And once I get all of it done, I'm going to transfer it into this one gallon carboy. And we'll probably get an initial taste test to see how things are going, see how it came out. So, take my ladle here, move around here, and basically I'm just going to scoop that big old scoop. Maybe. Everything has been sanitized. And cleaned and all that good stuff. It's coming out like a porridge. Okay, so get more. Push it through. Actually. Maybe it's not straining through the cheesecloth, so I'll pull the cheesecloth out. Squeeze out all the mockley that it soaked up. Actually, I'm going to try and pour it without pouring it all over the kitchen. Let's try it this way. This way, maybe a little bit better. It's going slowly. Um, figure out where I put it, but here we'll use this. This out. Get a little bit better now. And this is basically all I'm doing is taking my stir or my ladle and stirring it so the mockley can drain out. Then it's going to set for some time to let you know everything get good and strained out, which I will probably pause the video at that point, and we'll come back later and do our taste test. We got quite a bit of rice going on here. Kind of looks like oatmeal. It reminds me of. Um, I thought I could press it like you do when you press the rice for sake. Let me move the camera back a little bit. Um, doesn't look like it's going to work that way. So. It's got a real banana aroma to it. Um, it smells really good. So, let's go ahead and add some more. So, I'll return when I get all this stuff done and strained and ready to go. So, see you in a little while. Peace. Oh, I'm back. Um, we've got the Mockley transferred into the one gallon 
container or carboy. As you can see, I got about a half gallon of mockley out of my 2,000 grams of rice. That being a long grain rice and this being not a true mockley, I'm quite pleased with the results. Um, initial t tasting of it, it tastes like about probably 20% alcohol. Um, with the way this is made, there's no way of doing your original gravity, so it's by taste, and I don't really feel like doing the math to actually figure out what it is. So, this is good. Um, from videos that I've seen, um, the Koreans will dilute it down to about 5%. So I may go ahead and add water to this and fill this the rest of the way up and call it good. For, that should balance it out to about where it needs to be as far as the alcohol content goes. But something else. I saved some of the rice. Got it here. Give you a look. This used to be long grain rice. It's kind of mushy. Kind of looks like oatmeal but it is what it is um, I will I'm gonna let this sit probably put it in the fridge for a while let it cool down it's gonna separate when it separates it becomes two different alcohol there are two different drinks um, I'm not gonna try to butcher the names of the drinks but they, they you can you can serve it mixed like this it separates where you have the white on the bottom and you have like a clearish yellow liquid on the top so that's the finished uh, Mockley once I get it about where I want it taste wise I'll do a proper sit down with the glass pour it in the glass show you what it looks like video so until then good brewing peace and love